there are very few people on television that I would consider a celebrity chef. Who's Noah to cook? Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, you have so many celebrity chefs. They're on TV. They don't know how to cook. Yeah, they don't know they how don't. to cook anything. No, no, no. I mean, it's, that's what pissed me off the most. <laughs> no, seriously. No, it's really, absolutely. It's, it's very, uh, you know, I mean, we all work so hard. I work for 25 years, you know, in the kitchen. You know, like you say, the bottom to the top. You know, it takes time. Things don't come like this. You need to be patient. But when you watch TV, you know, it just sometimes it just the, the wrong message about about cooking. Right. It's the wrong I message. Also, you know, the unfortunate part is that. Uh, Today, it's not only being a good cook and having a nice restaurant that makes you successful. And uh, the other side is that temptation for, uh, for what television can bring to your restaurant. And I do remember when Susan was asked to be on MasterChef, she did call me and she said, are you going to be doing this? And I'm like, no. But she said, you know, they've asked me to do it. I've never done anything like this before. Or should I do it? What do you think? It's going to help business. Should I do it? And all I said to her is that I will believe in her as much as I do, right? She's a great cook, and I understood why she did it. And uh, she did it because in today's economy and in today's competition uh, or competitive restaurants, it's some of those TV chefs that are the ones that are the most successful. And I know that it brought a ton of business to your restaurant, and I know that it did to as I said earlier, to a lot of the other people that I knew that competed in, in that series. I mean, and I know, I think you did have a lot of fun in the end. It was yeah. hard, but I know that you did it because it was a business choice. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it was two, two things for me. The first year they asked me, I said, absolutely not. And I was opening streets, so it was a great excuse. The second year, um, I had you know called Nancy and a couple other people that were on, and I said, absolutely not again. And then... Many, uh, m many of our managers in our restaurant said, you have to do it, you have to do it. And I had sort of thought to myself, well, you just opened Street, you're, do you're playing for a charity, I can get the name of Scleroderma out right. there. Mm -hmm. So if I could, all I prayed for was, I just don't want to lose in round one. <laughs> 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 